Today's video, my entire handbag collection in year 2018. Please guys, stay tuned. Hello ladies, welcome to my channel. Thank you very much for clicking on this video. If you are new to my channel, please consider subscribing. I usually do a review of luxury handbags, luxury goods. Sometimes I do some modeling shots. So if you're interested in this kind of stuff, please, please, please consider subscribing. If you're a return visitor to my channel, thank you so very, very much for continue supporting me, for leaving your comments below. I adore reading all your comments. Today's video is my entire handbag collection for year 2018 and I hope guys that you're gonna enjoy this video. In this collection you're gonna see all the bags that I currently have in my collection. Some of the bags from this collection you're not like, I mean, some of the bags that I viewed on my channel in year 2018 might be no longer um, in my collection because they didn't work out for me. But whatever I have today on this screen is actually the bags that I have in my collection as per today. So I want to start with, um, like, you know, I'm going to start showing my collection in, in no any particular order. And I'm not going to, like, you know, spend much time on each bag. I just pretty much going to tell the name of the bag. And um, that's about it, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Maybe if I'm using enough or not using enough. So I'm going to start, I guess, from the very, very back. So this is uh, my one of my latest purchases and this is Chanel um, Business Affinity Top in cover leather with the champagne uh, gold hardware and it has a strap, shoulder strap and that's about it, it's just like you know standard business top. So that's so the next one is my pochette metis. I recently also viewed this bag in my most used bags of year 2018 and I have it in reverse monogram. The next bag will be my uh, Louis Vuitton palace with the blue leather insert because some of the palace they have with the canvas on the side, just pretty much the whole canvas with a little bit of the leather over here on the tops. But my um, bag has the leather on the sides with the blue insert. So that's the bag number three. The next bag that I have is my Burberry, um, uh, I think they call it small buckle and it's a small tot. Uh, in kind of like ox blood or burgundy color. The next one is uh, Sansel Pies, Louis Vuitton Sansel Pies in unprint leather in color noir. Once again, I was featuring this one in my five most used handbags in my collection. The next one is uh, Louis Vuitton Clapton Damia Bean in the cream and camel color. Uh, and once again, I used it, uh, I featured this bag in my five most used handbags in year 2018. The next one is my Speedy Bandolier 25 in Damier Azure print and that this bag I'm mostly using in summer so that's why I didn't cut into my uh, most used handbags of the, of the year. I do use this bag enough but only in summer months. The next bag is my holy grail. It's sitting right there on my lap. You can see there is all possible protective felts on this bag. And this bag is my um, Chanel medium, um, medium large classic flap. This is my holy grail, very, very special bag to me. I have it in cover leather with the gold hardware. In front of this bag, I have my Gucci Marmont camera style bag in size small um, with the antique gold uh, hardware. And this is in color nude or dusty rose, dusty pink. Every website call it differently. Uh, once again, I love this bag. On the back, it's just a Gigi, but I mostly use this bag once again in the summer months. 
The next box that I have over here is a speedy bandolier in size 25 damier bin and I do use this bag quite um, well. Uh, unfortunately it didn't cut to my uh, five most used bag of the year, not because I didn't use enough, it's just because I have to choose only five. <laughs> So I was trying to choose exactly the five that I mostly use, but I do use this bag very, very much. And in fact, right now it's stuffed with all my stuff because I was using uh, it today. So the next one is my Speedy Bandolier in size 25 dummy bin. After that, I have my um, um, Chanel mini chanel square mini it's from my once again latest uh, purchase it's a 19c collection uh, it's a black lamb skin with the silver hardware uh, i didn't have a chance to use this bag yet so it's pretty much brand new with all protective stickers so i absolutely adore this little uh, cutie the next bag in my collection it's um, Oh gee, I forgot the exact name of this clutch, uh, but it's multicolor um, canvas uh, collection of uh, Louis Vuitton, and I absolutely adore this bag. This is the only bag that I have in my collection with the uh, multi-color uh, uh, print of monogram, and I, I just want to have something in my collection, you know, with this very very unique print. And this is the clutch, and I'm mostly using this bag when I'm going on vacation. I, I, I absolutely adore it. I think it's a very, very cute, gorgeous bag. It has also absolutely gorgeous red interior. I never really did the review of this bag on my channel, but I'm mostly using this bag on for the vacation, and it's a um, fairly old bag. So that's the next bag. Um, the next one would be my Chanel Coco handle. Uh, once again, I featured this bag in my five most uh, used handbags of year 2018. I absolutely adore this bag, love it so very much and have no regrets whatsoever of purchasing this bag. After that, I have my uh, Speedy Bandolier 30 and it's a World Tour. I didn't go crazy with the uh, stickers, I just put one uh, black and white sticker on the side and obviously I choose um, uh, black um, handles. So that's what I love because it's all weatherproof and it obviously has a gorgeous red interior when you're choosing uh, black handles. So I do use once again this bag uh, quite a lot, but not enough that it was cut into my five most used uh, used handbags of year 2018. But I do love this bag so so very much. Next one is my um, Chanel. Uh, trapezio in uh, kind of dark blue color uh, with the antique uh, gold hardware and this is in the ship um, uh, skin once again love this bag absolutely adore this bag this bag somewhat uh, reminds me organization of Pochette Matisse it has three different compartments I do use this bag quite often once again I love using this bag when I'm wearing my denim it's very, very sad for me to say that it didn't cut into the uh, five most used bags of year 2018 and it's not because I didn't use it enough. Once again, it's only because I have to choose five for that specific video. Love, love, love this bag. And uh, I guess last but not least, it's my uh, Louis Vuitton Damier Bin Limited bag with the kind of burgundy touch and burgundy interior. I absolutely love this bag. Oh, something falling. <laughs> So there you go, Moji. Oh, I'm gonna put it right there. So um, I absolutely love this bag. This bag was actually number one in my most used handbags of year 2018. So that's so that's about it. That's the all well, all the handbags that I have right now in my collection. So let me count: one, two, three, four, five, six, 
7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So as for today, I have 16 bags in my collection. You know that it can always change. It could be less, it could be more. <laughs> Uh, so it's always fluctuates. It could be like, you know, more or less, etc. I hope guys that you enjoy this video. If you have any questions in regards to any of these specific bags, please do not hesitate. Put your comments below and I will gladly, gladly, gladly answer all your comments. Thank you very, very much for watching. Once again, please consider subscribing if you like the video. And I hope to see you again on my channel. And I guess until our next meeting. Bye-bye.